it's Kate here and today I wanted to share some really exciting news with you guys. So if all has gone to plan and Donington went straight forward um, since I've recorded this video in advance, you will have seen that I was rocking a brand new showy X Spirit 3 and some Sidi Vertigo 2 lay ladies boots. Now, I haven't got those by chance. I'm really, really proud and honoured to basically come out and say that I'll be representing Feridax on a social media front this year. So that means, you know, wearing the new Xperia 3 with the new graphic, wearing the city boots, talking about my experiences with them, being totally candid and real with you guys, and just basically sharing my experiences of the, the goods with you. So if you have any questions about the features or anything like that, I'm hoping to be that go-to person that you can ask and I'll try my best to sort of learn as much about the products as I can so that I can offer something a bit worthwhile to you guys as opposed to just saying, hey, look what I got. So uh, if you stay tuned, I'm going to do an unboxing where I show you the x 3 and the City Vertigo 2 Lay boots. So stay tuned and let's get opening them. Okay, so here is the box, the box that I've been waiting for. As you can see, X Spirit 3, Brink, TC1. The size that I have is extra small because I have a peanut swede, which in real terms is a 53 to 54 centimetre head. Now showies come with a five year warranty, which is absolutely exceptional. So, without further ado, so this is how you'll receive it if you do get yourself a Xperia 3. Now to be real with you guys, I couldn't help myself when I got the box delivered but to open it, pull everything out, have a look like a kid at Christmas would. So I have actually opened up the dark visor and fitted this pin lock that does come with it. Um, so I've just put this in here for aesthetic reasons, but that is how you would receive it. Okay, you can see the colours through it already. So, shall we have kindly given me a dark visor? These don't come with the Xperia 3, so be mindful that it is an optional extra when purchasing an Xperia 3. It also comes with these little gubbins, which I'll talk you through later. And let's have a look at the baby itself. Showy, you have excelled yourself with this graphic. Honestly, I don't think I've ever seen something so bright and beautiful, loud and leery before. But yeah, it's absolutely up my street. As some of you guys may know, I'm no stranger to an Xperia 3, but the design that I went for in the past was just the gloss black, stealthy ninja-like, and this time I wanted something loud and something that would really stand out on my track pictures. Premium helmet equals premium ventilation system. Down below you've got the lower air intake, and up above you've got the front air intake and the upper air intake as well. Moving on to the top of the helmet, that is where you have the top air outlet and the side air outlet. The Xperia 3 also comes with this nifty little visor locking system, which is really good when you're on the track and you're riding at high speeds. Just make sure that the visor's not going to flip up at any moment. Spinning the helmet round, you can clearly see the exhaust or the air outtakes on top. Since the helmet is a premium one, of course you are going to expect the double D ring system on the chin strap, the safest one there is. At the end of the chin strap you'll find a little popper which you can clip to the main bulk of the chin strap just to stop it flapping around in the wind. 
Moving on to the inside of the helmet, you can clearly see the quality in the padding. The cheek padding has some adjustment and has antibacterial properties. Moving on to that lovely bag of gubbins that I was on about before. First up we have the breath guard, which works perfectly combined with a pin lock. Rummaging a bit deeper, you'll find the lower air spoiler, which enhances air stream. Then we have the chin curtain, which restricts noise specifically from around the chin area. We're not quite done there. In the little pack, you'll find some silicon oil, which is ideal to grease up the visor since it's a moving mechanism. Just keeps it moving efficiently as it should. Stickers, because let's be fair, who doesn't love a good sticker? And oh then to finish off you get the Showy X Spirit 3 Encyclopedia, the ultimate bedtime reading. If you want to know about your X Spirit 3, this is where you look. Okay guys, so as mentioned, Showy Helmets UK have kindly sent me a dark visor. So I will show you how easy it is just to swap them in and out. It's a lot easier than you think. Firstly, you've got to crack open the visor and then you've got to pull down on this little mechanism. After you do that, give it a bit of a wiggle and it should pop off. Flipping it over, just repeat this step on the other side. I mean, this whole mechanism with the carbon fibre is just a whole beautiful thing in itself. Fitting the dark visor is slightly more difficult than taking it off or fitting a clear visor, just purely because you can't see through the visor to see exactly what bits need to line up where. But once you've got the visor open, things do just kind of slot into place uh, as long as you use that mechanism and pull it down. Another way that you can tell you're buying into a premium helmet is the visor itself. It's not just up or down with the X-Spirit 3. You can choose exactly how wide you have the visor open. So if you're riding along and you just want to crack it open a little bit for a bit of air, but you don't want the full thing open, then you can do that. And I think that's a really nice touch. Here, I thought I'd just demonstrate how easy it is just to pop on that breath guard as well. It literally takes a few seconds. I think even a five-year-old could master this. Time for the fashion show. Ooh, I feel seven years old again. As you can see, the fit on this is exceptional. It gives me that beautiful hamster chubby cheek look, which you know is a good fit. If you do find that you're in between sizes, shall we do offer customizable padding so you can have it fully customized to you or you can go for slightly thicker or thinner cheek pads basically if you have your heart set on this helmet there will be a way to make it fit i just love that new helmet snug feeling you know when you take it off and it gives you a mini facelift for approximately three seconds so guys i hope you enjoyed that quick little unboxing video of the showy x spirit 3 um please let me know in the comments below what you think about it if you like the design um if you have an x spirit 3 what design you have 
tell me your favourite bits about the helmet, best features that it has. Um, for me, I think the best feature and most unique feature is probably that cheek vent just here, which just allows all the air on a track day just to flow through your cheeks and keep your face nice and cool. So yeah, I'd probably say that's my highlight. Please let me know, I'd be really interested um, to hear what you guys think. Thanks for watching.